This is a, another short video of uh, how you can bypass the existing full of flaws air troll air pressure operated switch. Basically, per the ladder schematics, you will be wiring up the bypass switch by connecting it in parallel to the existing push button switch and the air troll. Before I begin, make the changes at your own risk. I take no responsibility. This is what works for me. Be careful because having a wire cable from the bucket to the platform can be dangerous during thunderstorms. Also, with the cable bypass, you can no longer work around wires or power lines, you know, that kind of stuff. Be careful. For this, you will need a short extension cable, maybe two to feet, three feet long or whatever, uh, which you should cut in half. You will also need an extension cable, roughly 60 feet long or so according to your bucket truck height, and then some. For the push button switch you'll be using while in the bucket, I found the typical starter jumper cables works just fine. Unfortunately, you will need to cut the switch with roughly a foot long of cable still attached to it. This end uh, you will then attach to the short extension male end of the uh, cable. The other female short cable gets attached to the platform push button switch. All three items in the box, the air troll switch, the push button switch, and the female short cable all connect together on the terminal board uh, inside. When done, the female ca cable should uh, hang just outside the box. Your basic bypass cable should look something like this. The nice thing about this setup is that you only need to use it when the air troll switch isn't working for you. It's so easy for the air troll to lose air pressure or require constant adjustments. The cable is a fail safe system. In the next two images, the first one is the way I use my bypass. And in the second image, I show how you could run a long enough extension cable through the lift arms or even attach it on the alongside the arms uh, with zip ties. Thank you for watching. Please give it a thumbs up so others will know this is a good video. Also, my videos that were banned uh, from YouTube can be seen at my LarryAndJane.com site. Just click on videos. Yeah, I got some of them banned like a lot of us do.